Hello everyone. I welcome you to my channel Canical Zone. Today we will do a two numericals on pressure intensity using pressure variation formula. We will calculate the pressure intensity using the pressure variation formula. And what is that uh, pressure variation of pressure inside a fluid at rest? The equation is V is equals to rho T Z rho T H. So, T is the pressure in the intensity of pressure or pressure intensity. Rho is the density. T is the acceleration due to gravity. Z or H both are same. You can say it as depth of fluid element inside the fluid which is at rest. Height of fluid element. So, let us come to the first question. The pressure intensity at a point in a fluid element is given by 3.924 Newton per centimeter square. Find the corresponding height of the fluid when the fluid is in water and in case of oil of specific gravity 0 0.9. Two cases are given. For the first case, uh, when the fluid is water second case when the fluid is oil so we have two uh, cases let us write down the data solve it solve it so what is given the pressure intensity is given over here you need to calculate the h or z whatever you want to take you can take 3.924 newton per centimeter square you can convert this into newton per meter square. 3.924 into 10 to the power 4 newton per meter square. So, what else is given? Given is first case is your water. You know the density of water is equals to 1000 kg per meter cube. Then the specific gravity of oil is given as 0 0.9. Why specific gravity of oil is given? In order to calculate the density of oil. The density of oil is equal to specific gravity of oil into density of water, which is equal to 0 0.9 into 10 to the power 3 kg per cube. 10 to the power 3 means 1000. I will tell you the way and you can solve it by your own. So, first case is water. In case of water, you need to calculate the Z. So, your Z that is the height of the fluid equals to Z will be P by rho to G. In this case, rho is rho for water e is equals to 3.94 to 10 to the power 4 then rho, G, rho w is equals to that is the density of water is power 3 e is 9.81 this one is 10 to the power 3 this is a thousand and calculate the value which will come equal then for oil, Z for oil, Z for oil is equal to pressure density of oil to G. Pressure is 3.24 to 10 to the power 4. Density of oil is equal to 10 to the power 3 and G is equal to 9. Here you will also get the answer in this. So, you can calculate the both of the height or height in case of water, height in case of oil, terms of meter. So, it is quite easy. So, let us go to the next problem. You can do the calculation by your own. Let us go to the next problem where we will solve. Here we will calculate the pressure. Calculate the pressure due to column of 0 0.3 meter of first water 
taken an oil of specific gravity of 0 0.8 so height is given is 0 0.3 then specific gravity of oil is given as 0 0.8 then mercury that is of specific gravity of 13.6 take the density of water is is so let us solve this what are the data are given we need to calculate the pressure intensity and you know the formula for pressure intensity is equals to p is equals to rho g z so what data are given z is given which is same for all that is for water this oil and mercury z is 0 0.3 meter then what else is given density of water is equals to percent kg per meter cube then you know the value of g is 9.81 per second here always uh, try to mention the units because units are important very important in order to calculate so first case uh, then what else data is given specific gravity of oil 0 0.8 why it is given in order to calculate the density of oil is the gravity of oil into density of water 0 0.8 to 10 to the power 3 kg per meter cube then what else data is given specific gravity of mercury that is 13.6 so that mercury is a heavier liquid that is why it is having a higher specific gravity the oil is a lighter liquid that is why it is having a lower specific gravity than water water has specific gravity of 1 13.6 to power 3 per meter cube so this uh, is your sm that is specific gravity of mercury into rho then let us solve the first part which is pressure intensity for pressure density for water it's all simple e for water is equals to O of water P into Z. O of water is equals to 10 to the power 3, which is 1000.81. Z is equals to 0 0.3. And you can calculate whatever you will get per meter square. Then, second part is for oil. The pressure for oil, pressure intensity for oil, density of oil is Z. This density of oil is equal to 0 0.8 into power 3 to 9.81 to Z is equal to 0 0.3. Then you can do the relation which will get written from it square. Then the Pressure intensity for mercury. So pressure for mercury is equal to the mercury is equal to 13.6 to 10 to the power 2 in 0.81 to 0. Point. From this you get answer in per meter square. So we can do the calculation part, which is quite easier. Hopefully, we can solve all this. Hope you have understood how to solve this type of problem. So, thank you very much. Let us meet in another video.